Three, two, one. My dad told me that his Chromebook would not turn on anymore. I popped over to see him and could instantly see that the USB-C charging port had been broken. I opened up the Chromebook to see if the USB-C was connected via a daughter board. Unfortunately, it soldered onto the main board, which is way beyond my basic soldering skills. So we're really hoping that we can get this USB-C port fixed. Really interested in taking a look at this laptop. I have no idea. I don't fix laptops. It's not something that I take on. But again, I've just confirmed with the person that they're happy for me to take a look at it. It's not turning on. So clearly it's completely out of battery. Uh, we've got several screws on the outside of the laptop. So this should be relatively easy, right? I'm thinking it should be relatively easy. Let me show you the port itself first. So we can clearly see that this port needs replacing you can also see that there's a uh, there's a pin over here it's just gone hey why i don't know where that's gone but again i don't know what to expect i'm sure that people with a lot more experience and confidence will just be like crack 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 but uh i'm just gonna take my time here we go another one another one another one Whew. okay cool so that's been uh taken off the USB C port we're talking about is right over here in the corner so it's soldered onto the motherboard so i now just need to take this apart first things first i'm pretty sure people tell me disconnect the battery joey like anything electric i guess the silver latch i think i just push out there we go and then does this just come off it does look at that jubbly first try we've done it let's uh head over and inspect this usb c port and see how challenging that's going to be to replace wow would you look at that um this should be technically i'm gonna say it relatively easy the board is very thin so I also have to be careful about potentially bending the board. If I turn it round, how are we looking on the back? Uh, so it is indeed through hole. I'm going to start with 380. Airflow speed, I'm going to whack up to 70%. Here we go. Just like that. Wicked. Nice. That's exactly what I wanted. And let's have a look at the back. You can see that there's pins that have come through here. And they've pushed that little bit of solder through. I need to make sure that all of those are connected. And by the looks of it, they look connected. Okay. Three, two, one. Okay, good. We get 15. It goes up 170. Do we see something on the laptop like the screen? Does it boot? The charging light is on. That's a win. We get 2.8 amps. That is uh, That looks like it's charging the battery to me. That's good. I'm just looking around to make sure that I've got everything else plugged in. Maybe the battery's just flat, flat. Oh, no, there we go. Chrome OS. Yo. Wow. Amazing. We got life. It's on. Just like that, we managed to fix the laptop in question. Actually, big shout out to Andy who sent this in on behalf of his father. 